Happy Friday, it's January 20th, and usually hashtag Chad is here, but Sean Toulon is in his place. We bumped Chad, didn't we? We did, Amanda. We, we said, have Get big out news. Of here. We do. We have way bigger news than social, social Media Friday, and that is we have brand new products to announce we do. from Sean Toulon Design. Well, it's just Toulon Design. It's your son's, too. I it always is. say Sean Toulon Design, <laughs> but it's a family affair, it, right? It is, absolutely. And we have four new putters that we are totally jacked up about. I love it and we yeah. are really excited too. Can we start with the one that's in your hand? Yeah. Because it is one of the coolest designs and backstories I've ever heard about a putter and yeah. I think people are really going to be buzzing about this. Well thanks. Uh, so far we've shown it to tour players and they have gone crazy for yeah. it. Um, we've shown it to good amateurs um, that happened to be at a tour shoot that we were doing. They went crazy for it. So it's our new Indianapolis putter. It was inspired by uh, some time I spent with the Chip Ganassi racing team a, a few years ago, which so was cool. really cool. And the reason why it was important to get with them is we were beginning to get curious about multi-material construction. So this is a, a high MOI putter. Usually those things are like ginormous, right. right? You need a pizza box for a head cover. And so we wanted to kind of design a high MOI putter that sort of would punch above its weight a little bit, if mm, you would. Yep. So it's got about almost 5,500 MOI, so it's a very stable product, but it's also not that big because we use aluminum, uh, milled aluminum, milled 303 stainless steel, which is really heavy on the bottom, and a carbon fiber composite top um, that, that creates incredible sound, incredible feel, great roll, just awesome performance and the players have just gone crazy for the look. Well, and it, yeah, I mean, it looks amazing, and we mentioned how Toulon Design is a family affair. Yep. I have to say, this probably is a little bit inspired by your dad, right? It, it is, so my dad has been in the car business his whole life yeah. and was a great amateur race car driver uh, back in the day, so yeah, it's, it's sort of in we our blood. It. It, it, and it's been great, and then to spend time with Mike Hall and Chip Ganassi and that team, and we've become friends, um, it's, it's been awesome. It's been a great experience, oh, but it, so it, cool. it, it helped us create an incredible product. All right, so Indianapolis, keep your eye out. Today is the first day we are talking about any of these models. Right. We got uh, Strong Island, Long Island up next, right? <laughs> we do. Which... I went to Hofstra, so did you, AJ. AJ's from there, so I have a feeling he probably already has one on order, he, right? He doesn't. I think he stole one out of my office <laughs> so he didn't have to. Right. But it's a beautiful, it's a really difficult putter to design. Mm -hmm. uh, because It's very classic. So it's a little bit longer blade, kind of a pintail style, so it's really a throwback, mm -hmm. but it's got a cavity in it, so it's it's more forgiving, a beautiful flow neck, and then it has our face technology, which helps get the ball rolling better, and which all of our putters do. We really kind of took an old school design and brought it into 2017. And fun cool. fact, that one also looks really cool when you fist pump with it. It does. Because that's what people do on, on Long Island, they fist pump. Uh, I didn't I, know I that. Know. For those of you out there from Long Island, you know what I'm talking but about. But it's a putter that, the same sort of design that Patrick Reed has putted with yes. and, and he, Patrick was the first one to get one uh, so he's working with that so hopefully we do see a fist pump there with we Patrick go. I love one. it all yeah. right so we have Indy we see have how I tied Island. that together and that was well done Clever. by you Sean it's uh, like you're getting used to uh -huh. this on camera business uh, third one what's the third city third one is Austin Austin Texas yeah okay. so we love to, to with these names you know they're not just alphanumeric they, they have meaning right? right so Austin is a great golf town uh, obviously Harvey Penick and Tom Kite and Ben Crenshaw and all of that, right? Um, but this, so this is a beautiful throwback design again, just a really clean, classic uh, cavity back blade, um, kind of a flat top line, line in the top, lots of activity with collectors already on this model, yeah. uh, lots of just great buzz with it. It looks phenomenal. So that one we're really excited about. And then the final one, even though I'm a badger, I know this one hurt your heart this, a little bit. It, I feel it did like. a little bit, but Columbus, uh, <laughs> Ohio, is an incredible golf town. Yeah. Between that and Austin, Texas, the top two golf towns in the country, mm -hmm. right? So great golf courses, great history. So we did Columbus, and and we're always inspired by something that in the city, right? Right. With Columbus, the stadium is a horseshoe, and I, you know, those. Darn wow. Buckeyes. You even went so far as to develop it after the stadium. Well, kinda, but it's a <laughs> notchback design with a longer neck, so it's a blade that sort of behaves a little bit like a mallet, but it just looked like that darn stadium that my Badgers don't usually do that well That's in. That's true, and they don't. So Columbus is, is a really cool product too, so that comes out for a 2017 well, model. I got good news for you, your Packers are still kicking. They are. So let's focus on the good. So we should football. do a Green Bay. We should do a, and what, Why and wouldn't we? I have a feeling maybe like a Pittsburgh-ish themed one should come out. What do you think? We have something not far away coming. 
We'll talk about that yeah. one later. I may <laughs> have right. stolen that one from your office, Sean. Thank you so much. You better, uh, for those of you who are looking for more information on these putters, the new site on odysseygolf.com, you'll be able to check all of this out on the 25th, 25th right? 25th, yeah. But we'll go don't live. worry. All of the embargoes have officially been lifted, which means you're going to be seeing these babies all over media, all we over will. the PGA show. And we are going to be live from the PGA show, by the way. Will you join us on a Facebook Live yeah, so we absolutely. can show these putters of, live? Of course we will. All right, keep yeah. an eye on our Facebook page, Callaway's Facebook page, and uh, we will see you next week in Orlando. Look forward to it. Have yeah. a great weekend, guys. Yeah.